Jollymont High Witness News. I'm Jenny Hills. And I'm Travis Coyne. Tonight, school authorities investigating after the shock discovery of a clean toilet in the boys' bathrooms. <laughs> Year 9 girls caught up in skipping rope tangle drama. <laughs> and Stuart Nolan's facial hair, beard or bum fluff. But first, reporter Ruby Rudd met with Vice Principal Peaks in his office this week to try to get to the bottom of a question that students have been asking for generations. What is school Actually. for? <laughs> Principal Peak, thank you for joining us. Uh, pleasure. So, Principal, how would you address reports that there is no real point to school? <laughs> no point to school? Uh, well, I can't really say I've heard uh, such reports, uh, Ruby. For example, one often claimed reason for school is that it prepares students for employment later on in life. Yes, that's a very good reason. No, it's horse poo. Excuse me? Can you name a career in which they ring the bell every hour and everybody changes whatever it is that they are doing? Uh, for example, this morning I started my day off with maths, then I moved to art, then biology. Now, how do any of these relate to each other in any way? Well... So, how does school have anything to do with a real job? For example, have you ever heard of a job in which, say, you work as an accountant for an hour and then you move to a different room and suddenly you're a sculptor? And then by the afternoon you're dissecting frogs? Well, I don't really think you've got a... Do you know of a job in which you would change bosses every hour? Sometimes the boss is nice, sometimes the boss is strict. Sometimes the boss is an A-grade moron with his socks pulled up to his hairy knees. Well, I hardly think... Not to mention that these various bosses can assign you an unmeted amount of work that you have to do in your own spare time with absolutely no additional pay. So now you're solving algebraic equations, painting pictures of naked ladies and collecting bug specimens on your weekend. Look, Why don't you just come clean, sir, and let everyone know that school does not in any way prepare anyone for a real job at all. All right. All right. You found us out, OK? The only reason for school is to keep people like me off the streets. I thought so. There you have it, folks. First hand, there is absolutely no point to school. And that's all we have time for tonight. But before we go, school bully Rory Bentley got more than he bargained for today when divine intervention saw him get struck down by lightning. <laughs>